Hello, welcome back to another video of Euro Truck Simulator 2 with me, Zaki, as your friendly truck driver. Um, under Solo's uh, company. And even though that's the case, I still don't own one. So I'll have to go hit the job market and have a quick job and earn some money. Let's see, our last destination was Almeria, so we'll start from Almeria and let's go from there. Uh, no, we don't want to go back to Mercia, so we'll probably take Violin. Was it Violin? Great. We're gonna deliver marble blocks, 22 tons, for 3,600 euros. Let's go ahead. Oh, it is dark, dark. Oh, but the sky is so nice. Um, let's go ahead and get started. Let's see if we have a built-in GPS. Go. We don't. So we're going to stay with our screen's GPS. Uh, Alright. So is this the right way to go to the exit by going down here? Ooh, very rocky. And I'm seeing my trailer at the back hitting the rocks. Hmm. Well, I guess this is just here. Very cool environment though great experience it wasn't just you know straight roads always sometimes it happens that you have this kind of road oh then it gets better great I have to okay I can go 80 let me just be a little safe on the curve. Looks like this is a cliff. And on a rocky mountain side, so we don't want to go too to fast. Turn left. Ah. Turn Let's left. do that. Okay. Okay, good turn. How long would this be? Three hours. Nice. We can go as fast as 70 for today. This is just 32. More. Go straight. Alright, straight it is. Ah. Uh, A nice quiet night time. Is it night? Yeah, almost midnight. 54. I think we're good with 54 for now. We'll probably increase it later. Why are some of these things not showing my GPS? Or maybe they are really not part of the road? Ooh, I'll have to. Turn right soon. At the roundabout, take the first exit. Exit now. Granada? Isn't that grenade in English? You have a place called Granada. That's cool. Grenade, very explosive. Oh, I shifted my gear up, which shouldn't really work. That was wrong. Uh, I think I need to merge on the left side, so thank you. Ah, we're speeding up. 
Yeah, oh... I have a feeling this should be a nice view, but it's just quite dark right now. But it's really calm and quiet with just the, not the right amount of traffic, not too empty as well. So I am enjoying. But anyway, I did have a question <laughs> last um, driving I had in um, Elmeria, or I think it, it was in Mercia, where I saw too many roundabouts. So I started questioning, is that a thing there or is it a thing like in Spain or something? Or maybe it was just like an in-game thing in Euro Trucks. So I had to research on it to find my own answers. And what I found out is that Spain do have a lot of roundabouts. They have around 36,000. Almost second to France across Europe with the most roundabouts in number. But there, I think they are around uh, in the fifth place when it comes to roundabouts per thousand of inhabitants and i don't know maybe that's how they really measure it but that's a ton of roundabouts that's 30 36 thousand that was um that's a lot oh so you're the kind of truck that gives that kind of a signal i thought you were an emergency one. Oh, but yeah I learned that um, earlier to answer my question about the roundabouts but I also got to you know ask if roundabouts if they're really helpful or maybe they're not um, it, it's just that you know I'm not that used to it I do know a few roundabouts like I, we do have them here as well in our place big one a little one and I think they do. They they are helpful, but I, I just want to see like some scientific research about them as well. And what I learned was that aside from um, improving the traffic flow, it gives or at least it would have or it would result to less idle time to cars or um, vehicles which means lesser fuel consumption so i think that's a win condition when it comes to roundabouts as well aside from the traffic flow but uh i was wondering and i'm still wondering what happens if there's an accident doesn't that like stop the entire flow unlike when you have a traffic light because you'll you know if you have a traffic light you can just have an enforcer there and direct people hey um this is the direction you can go to to just you know um go through the uh or, or across to cross the road but for a roundabout it seems impossible because they will be blocking the only passageway to go through the next few exits so for example there's an accident on the first exit how would people that need to go out on like exit two and the second or third exit right what viewpoint ah uh, i was not looking around much Ooh. but yeah i wonder how that one is dealt um like do you have to change the flow of the uh, of the roundabout going counterclockwise does that work because the thing about about it is that on a roundabout it's not like if there is a traffic on the first exit or blocking the first exit is that you can just go straight to your exit no you can't because there is something blocking on the middle of the cross road which usually you know people do intend to put something there like a statue or um, a tree or something to make it a roundabout right so that no one can really go through the next exit without going around 
so I wonder how they deal with that because I, I have a feeling it would take longer to resolve compared to the regular traffic lights um, when you have an accident there I think it's easier to resolve compared to the one in roundabout ah, but uh, yeah that was just my rumbling about roundabouts because <laughs> I had to learn them <laughs> I, I was just thinking about it if it was an in-game thing or a Spain thing I think I'm a little slow um, where there's so many roundabouts in Spain so it seems like it is it is a thing in Spain Ooh, what's happening stay right and then exit right is there Exit right. Ah, so do I need to detour? Can I can I still do this? Or no? Can I ignore this? We were just talking about traffic. Is it okay to actually do this? I actually don't know. Oh, I know I could do a detour but I just want to test it out if I can just go through if no one will give me a fine ah looks like I was able to go through it <gasps> hello what are you guys doing hello are you guys busy Oh, that's a poor car. Well, that doesn't look like a new car. That looks like a, you know, that's rusted already. Are you guys just chatting there? Waiting for someone to pick it up? Hmm? Uh, you guys are driving, uh, you know, you guys are blocking our way. Just for your information. But thank you for letting me. I think I didn't have any fine. So that's cool. <laughs> okay, didn't have to find a detour. I was actually planning to see if I should, but looks like the road is kind of open. So let that be. We get away scratch, scratch free. Uh, all right. Let's go faster again. But it's a very good scenery. It feels so real. Ah, uh, look at the night sky. Sixty-eight. We're already at seventy, and I'm already this fast. More. Let's go until eighty only. Seventy-five, seventy-six. The truck just goes crazy whenever I try to steer a little left or a little right so I'm kind of scared with going very fast it looks like it's gonna be like a straight line look at that I feel like I'm driving into constellations my truck is going crazy <laughs> Ooh, we're gonna go th through a tunnel how long is this tunnel? A short one? Ah. Wow.
Now I don't really see the other things, but I've seen very good designs earlier, just like a warehouse that we saw. We are going to Bylin, yeah. Is that how you pronounce that? I don't know those um, E with accents on them, so... I'll probably correct myself on the next one if I pronounce this wrong. Ah. Really? It's like, the ambience is really nice. Oh, that was scary. A little. Oh, we're about to take a roundabout in a few minutes. Oh, we're there already? 34 minutes? Stay left, and then exit left. Exit left. Did I even stay left? I am... Um, let's... Um, See how big this uh oh it's not a roundabout. You see this is what I'm talking about. It's a little crazy. It's getting a little crazy here. But we did it. Stay left. Ah, I need to stay left so there's no cars behind me. Great. There are tons of stars that I can see in my mirror though. Ah. We're near our place. Yes. Oh, look at that. That's cool. Stay right and then exit right. Oh, now this time I have to go to the right. Sorry, exit I was right. swerving. Get ready to turn left. Uh, I did slow down. Turn left. Okay, very smooth. No, not really. <laughs> I was packing, but looks like we're very near the place. Turn left. turn left again. I cannot see it. My headlights turn is left. not helpful. Oh, there you go. Violin is here. Oh, thank you. Thank you for Turn letting right. me. Oh, DOM Depot? Ooh. Now, I had a problem with this automatic gates last time. It was a nice ride. Thank you. Yeah, it was. Um, but I hate this automatic doors or gates. Great! No hiccups at all. <sighs> I don't know when I will try the one like an expert parking. Oh, uh, because I'm really bad at them. But for now, let's play it safe. Where do you want me to go at the back of um, this building? Or warehouse? Hmm. Ah, there you go. I wonder where you'll 
ask me to park if you would want to do it like expertly but this looks just about right uh-huh good job everybody 252 kilometers for it took me five hours but good job! We earned more money and heading towards level 3. 